All right. Sit. I'm not playing this no more. <laughs> nah, nah, this is not my type of game. It's not fun. All, all that time I spent hunting this guy, slash, slashing him all day. Get out of here. And I run out of time. It took 50 minutes to figure out how to play with friends. I had to, without, if I wasn't streaming this, I would have no idea what I was doing at all. Like, it doesn't seem very, like, I don't know if it's just because it's the beta or what, but it's like I have, I have to just know stuff about the game without ever playing the game before. Like, for new players, it didn't explain nothing. I don't know what my weapon does, how to use it. I'm just pressing buttons. And then, I don't know. No, I don't, I don't, not fun at all. It was like, I was actively, like, pissed off the whole time playing. I just want to kill him to get something out of all the time that I spent. Like, I feel like it's, I feel like I see why people like it, and it is cool, like the animations and the different weapons and like slicing up a creature and seeing it bleed, but nah, nah, it's it just, it ain't clicking, it's not, no, I don't know, it's like, I, can't, I feel like I can't explain right now because I'm still kind of upset, so maybe like next time when I can like reset and like fully explain how I felt this whole time because I feel like the game isn't like explaining like so if you look the weapon category there's a tutorial for it there's a tutorial no you're talking about the little video that plays it takes some getting used to yeah I don't think I have the patience yeah, I've seen that little video. That video don't don't do nothing. <laughs> it's no audio. It's no direction. It's no explanation. It's just showing them slicing with the weapon. Like it didn't tell me how to, with them little slots at the top. Was y'all was trying to explain to me? It didn't say nothing about that. Unless y'all talking about something else that I haven't seen. I appreciate the super chat, by the way, Zerk. Thank you. Shout out to you. Um, yeah, it's just. I just don't. I don't feel like I don't feel like I have the patience. It asks hours to be familiar with fight system menu, use of timing of the weapons and everything. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just not for me. Maybe I just don't feel like I have the patience. Or maybe it's just because they just throw you in in the beta and I need to be walked through the game and understand because I've never played before. I don't know what it is, but it's very frustrating to just want to hop in and play and kill some stuff and not understand anything. And like to fight for 20 minutes and still not kill it. Like it's, that's, it's, boring to just keep pressing buttons and slicing on the same animal and then it's running away every so often you got to chase it and then I don't know it's just a whole lot and it just I, it just wasn't fun I mean at the end of the day it wasn't like certain parts were the highlight of the fight like when I was able to like hit the wounds target the wounds or like actually hit them for a while but that was like brief compared to like the the entirety of the fight. I mean, well, the quest, the time limit for the quest was like 50 minutes, wasn't it? So, I mean, not to say that I was fighting for 50 minutes, but it sure felt like it was f forever. It's like a huge learning curve. And I feel like maybe it's just not helping me understand, helping me adjust to that learning curve very well as somebody fresh into this whole thing. And I tried to play with y'all, so even that's not really a thing. If it was meant for playing with friends, why was it so hard to do that? This is my best advice for you play Monster Hunter World to get a feel for the game, then when this game comes out, you will be more prepared. <sighs> 
is Monster Hunter World free? Because this experience doesn't make me want to spend money on another Monster Hunter, I can say that. Because even w when we were all in a group together, I didn't know where the heck y'all was. I couldn't see y'all on the map. I couldn't even see y'all in front of me. The icons all looked the same. It wasn't like y'all was a different color. I mean... <laughs> Maybe it's on Game Pass. I could check. Yeah, and that could be the case. Maybe they do want me to be more familiar with the game. Like, maybe that's just what you have to do. You just have to be familiar with this, with Monster Hunter before you can come in and play. Thank you again for the super chat, though, Zerk. Appreciate it, man. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I can see if it's on, on Game Pass, but to buy it when I don't think I'll like it or to, to on a chance that I may like it. I don't know. It's not like super appealing. It's because I'm in town. This game isn't optimized at all. The, just, the town trashes everyone's PC. Mm. It won't be on Game Pass anytime soon. I see it on the Xbox app. I, it pops up. Um, I didn't actually check on my PC though, because I'm still in the game. <laughs> we should have looked up how to play together. I mean, I, I wouldn't think that you would need to. <laughs> in any other game, you just figure it out and it's not that difficult. At least that's what I would assume, but. I mean, it's fine. I just think, I think I need to. <laughs> I think I just need to listen to myself. And if I keep playing, if I keep trying to force it, it's not gonna end well for me or frankly for y'all because it's not enjoyable to watch me in a state of, a state of not goodness. <laughs> so I could try the Monster Hunter World if it's on Game Pass and see but I feel like I tried it before, but this was off stream. Me and Enzo tried to play it together. And it was like every NPC had like 50 years of dialogue that you have to read yourself, which <laughs> uh, kind of made me stop playing after that. But if it's free, I could try to give it another shot. I gave this one another shot to really see. look up tutorials. See, I gotta care about a game to look up stuff on YouTube. I ain't just gonna, a game shouldn't make me have to look up stuff when I'm new to the franchise. This is Monster Hunter. This is Monster Hunter Wilds. The beta. Imagine how long it takes for a big boss. I mean, like, like, I don't know. You think the issue is that the game is entertaining enough for me to enjoy that higher learning curve? I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just one of those games you gotta play with a group. So, uh, yeah. The AI hunters with the SOS flare, but I don't want to play with no computers. Like, why do I have to follow all these rules in order to just play a game that I'm interested in? Like, that feels like such, that feels like garbage. Like, I'm not trying to be super hard on the game. I know it's people who really enjoy this game and really find fun in it. But like, that's that's part of the reason why I said I didn't want to like really talk about it while I'm upset because I feel like I'm gonna just be saying stuff and like, but it that just feels like that. That's, that's trash. Like, I should be able to just hop in and try a brand new, not having ever played. Like, a game should, not saying this should babysit me, but if I've never played your game before, 
like wouldn't you want me to you know want to continue playing and want to learn and understand what's going on and not feel like like a I don't know I mean I shouldn't have to call in AI if I just want to hop in and kill some monsters <laughs> I don't want to do that <laughs> I could, I'll play with other people, like friends, but I don't want to play with no robots. That's like playing, uh, what's that game? I can't think of it. Was it Back for Blood, that zombie game with computers? Or any zombie game for that matter. First you master the weapon, then you master the monsters. But I could see if it was just I had to learn to get better. But it's not just I have to learn to get better. It's that I feel like the game isn't even giving me the information to learn. Like, unless I'm just, I missed the big red sign where it said, read this to understand. But every, I played the tutorial all the way through, read everything. Uh, I went in my tent. I watched, I, I, I did the weapon quiz. I put on the different weapons. I watched a little video that I showed you, but it doesn't give me no real information to really understand what the heck am I doing? What am I pressing? What does this mean? What does that do? What does that do? Like, I got, like I said, I feel like if I wasn't streaming, I would be so lost. The game became a lot more fun when you actually learned your weapon, how to fight monsters properly. And I can see that. Like I said, I understand what people like about it. Like I had highlights of some of the fights where it's like, okay, that was really cool. But that little bit of coolness, that little cool factor that was only for a second or two wasn't enough to carry me through the 20 minutes of like just hacking and slashing, not really knowing what I'm doing and chasing after this guy <laughs> forever. And then he groups up with everybody else and then it was just, it was just annoying. So yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna just, I, I know everybody got their own, you know, opinions they own experiences they who probably played this game in the past or all all, all of all of that but i think i'm gonna just try the other one see how it goes if it's free on game pass like i said and go from there i mean it's not that i think it's a bad game it's just i think uh, as somebody just coming in fresh i feel like i had i had a bad experience i guess so, yeah, uh, that's kind of all I got. <laughs> so, yeah.